My name is Paul Sohar and I have two poems in Literature Today, volume number eight. The first one is in memory of my daughter who passed away a short time ago. It's called Father's Day. Okay, if I am to play the daddy again, and the day's program is mine, then let it be adventurous, I used to say. Let's go swimming in Crater Lake, if weather allows. If not, let it be educational. Let's visit a historic building or a museum or a natural wonder like I planned for today. Let's visit Crystal Caves in Hellertown. I know you've been there before, a couple of times with the group, but you never got past the gift shop, and now we have a chance to see the whole place and learn about its wonders. Life is a learning process, as we say. We keep accumulating loaves of wisdom for old age, and I am in it now but without a crumb for my mind to nibble on, with you gone without a reason, and I am still foolish enough to keep on asking why on my first Father's Day alone, an abandoned natural wonder overgrown with memories. The second book in this, uh, second poem in this book is the sun rides a bicycle. This is about a neighbor who was teaching uh, his uh, daughter to ride a bicycle. When the sun visits our dead end street, it never fails to bring a bicycle with it, a small one learning to roll. Or is it the road that feels an itch and shakes a bicycle out the folds of its black top skin. Wheels rolling, flickers of spokes and silent speed. There is always a t-shirted, lean-muscled beard running after them, but he doesn't catch up until the road shakes the rolling loose tipping the bike into a cripple, into a pile of tears and bruises, plus the beard cursing the sun for failing to roll along. But when the next time the sun decides to take a stroll on our street, the same wheels come out to greet it with the same lean t-shirted beard running after them. Thank you.